it makes no sense to think that your faith can be anchored by the one thing that should destroy it the most. The people who have lost most live the bravest lives. I think sometimes the only way you can learn to live is by walking through the hard moments. There's one chapter in this book where I, I actually am on my knees and um, I'm reading a piece of Oswald Scott Chambers' devotional, My Utmost for His Highest. He said, if God can use your heartaches to do good in the world, then why wouldn't you thank him for breaking your heart? It makes no sense. Until you realize that until your heart is broken, you can't do business with it. It was the first time I was able to realize that what looked like the worst possible thing you could want in the world was going to be a point of connection with other hurting people. If my pain can be a way that people meet God and see that He's good in the face of everything, that's a humbling thing, right? That's my heart behind it. Like, the heart's broken, might as well do something with it.